You wouldn't believe the black inventor. They called the Black Edison and how he changed modern transport forever. What if I told you that long before electric trains became common, a self-taught black inventor solved deadly railway problems and even defeated Thomas Edison in court? Granville Taylor Woods was born on April 23, 1856, in Columbus, Ohio. Forced to leave school at age 10, he worked as a railroad laborer, machinist, and blacksmith. While working on trains, he noticed a major danger. Moving trains could not communicate, leading to frequent accidents. By teaching himself electrical engineering, Woods began inventing in the 1880s. In 1887, he patented the induction telegraph, a device that allowed trains to communicate while in motion, greatly improving railway safety. In the late 1880s, Thomas Edison challenged Woods' patents in court. Woods won, proving the inventions were his own. Edison later offered him a job, which Woods declined. Between 1884 and 1907, Woods earned nearly 60 U.S. patents, including electric railway and third rail power systems. In 1890, he patented an electric railway system that influenced modern subways and electric transit. Some of his systems were demonstrated in New York, including early electrically powered track applications. Despite his impact, Woods faced financial hardship and limited recognition. He died on January 30, 1910, at age 53. Today, modern rail and electric transit systems still rely on ideas created by Granville T. Woods. The inventor history calls the Black Edison,